Elsie Gabbard's statement on the survey about gender and early childhood education raises significant concerns about parental rights, government overreach, and the preservation of children's innocence. My parents homeschooled all five less kids at home growing up in Hawaii. And what she saw in our public schools uh, back in 2000 was the beginning of what is now happening all across the country in broad daylight. Back then, she saw how wrong it was that in public schools across the state of Hawaii, they wanted to put out surveys to kids in grade school, first, second, third grade, about what their sexuality is. She raised us not to be complainers, but to be problem solvers, and she led by example. Her remarks are seen as a critique of what she views as excessive government involvement in education, emphasizing the importance of upholding parents' rights and responsibilities. The public's interest reflects unease over the role of public institutions in influencing children's development, with a strong desire to protect the purity and innocence of childhood. Surveys on children's gender are particularly troubling to many, as they are perceived to undermine parental authority and risk steering children's personal development in ways that may not align with authentic free choices.